beautiful welcome back to my channel today's video is a get ready with me i just you know kick the shit with y'all it's no defined thing of what i'm talking about today i'm just here to get cute and have a good time if you want to get cute with me have a good time with me stay tuned and keep watching shout out to s love s saw hair for sponsoring today's video all hair information will be linked in the description box down below and if you want to see how i got this complete entire look stay tuned and keep watching It's giving very much like throwback. We got the old fake ass glitter back, bro. It's not giving glitter. Is it glittering to y'all? All right, I got my old robe on. I got my ball cap on. It's giving we're gonna put on a wig. Who would have thought we put on a wig on this channel? Today's hair comes from S Love. S Soul. I think it's S Love. And it's like a water wave esque, um, you know, curl. It's not called water wave though, it's called something else. But it's giving water wave, it's giving like looser, juicy curls. So I just wanna do a cute little half of up down. Not too crazy. Got the HD lace going on, I'm excited about that. So we gluing this bad boy on. I'm gonna use my Erica J glue to hold me down. I love this glue, one of the best glues. And I already got two layers of glue on my head. It probably should be dry now. And we can get to installing. And um, this is just gonna be a little cute, like get ready with me. I probably already said that in the beginning, but I don't got anything in particular I wanna talk about. I just came to buy and put on a wig and get ready to go out with my friends. I'm gonna show y'all my outfit and I'm gonna do my makeup. Um, it's gonna be my little quick 10 minute routine, nothing too crazy. And then I am gonna show you my outfit. Now I'm not wearing that. This time me and my friend's going to Applebee's in a movie. You feel me? I ain't wearing this to Applebee's in a movie, but <laughs> I gotta make the content. So I'm gonna show y'all this outfit I wore last weekend that I didn't get no pictures in. I'm gonna try to get pictures in now. So yeah, let's just get started and put on this wig. What in the world will we talk about? I have no clue. I already plucked it and I do have on my ball cap and I have both tutorials, not from this exact wig and this exact ball cap, but I have both tutorials on updated ball cap method to where I don't cut my elastic band around it so it keeps all my hair tucked in the back. And I have a plucking tutorial on how I pluck curly wigs because I don't like to pluck mine wet. That's that, if you wanna look into that, you can go ahead and look in the description box for my OnlyFans. I got it all separated because um, I had to pluck it, so this is the, I ain't gonna tell y'all, watch my OnlyFans video. I know it's been a while since I've done a wig on here, but I'm going with the same mode, same mode, even tinted lace braid in the shade medium, what, what, what shade it is? It's that one. Why is it? What was that finna do? So how are y'all doing? What's tea? Like, I just been living life. Um, and that's it. I've been literally living every day. My, my fan finally broke. My dollar fan finally broke, y'all. It's kind of sad. It's the end of an era. I've just been living life. I've been waking up and I've been like, here I am to live again. And I go live. This got a cute little elastic band on it. So I'm gonna try to use it and see what happens. I don't think I'm have too much trouble with the wig. Sometimes I be like really struggling and I be having to pull it together. This one seems like it wants me to tug on it a little bit to get it into place, but you feel me? I don't mind a little tuggy tug. I'll do the tuggy tug as long as you know it's tuggy tug in place. So yeah, here's a wig. It's giving very much HD. Very much invisible, very much HD. I'm so fucking glad. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> the medium brown lace wigs are just not my tea. Like they're just not my my tea they're not my tea they're not my personal cup of tea they're just not and i try to make them work i try to give them these fat ass baby hairs but the, but the baby hairs will not cover up that dark ass lace if you came for a tutorial baby just i'm just here to have a good time so you can either stick around and have a good time with me or that's it you have no choice now you have to say i don't make the rules okay so this is how my wig is gonna be i'm gonna go ahead and cut my ear tabs because i want to I'm just out here living life. I am overwhelmed, I guess. Capitalism cap capitalism is the worst thing that could have ever happened to all of us. And you know, living through that on a day-to-day -day basis is just terrible. But thankfully, you know, I got me a little boo so I can, you know, forget every now and again that like I have to pay bills. So yeah, I guess my little boo is the best thing that's ever happened to me. My my motherfucking baby. 
not the best thing that's ever happened to me, but like, it's it's really nice right now. Ear is out. You ever just like realize that you've been doing something one way your entire life and like you could try to do it a different way? So that's me right now, cutting my ear ties first. Let's just do this like all out of whack. Like, let's just, let's just be different, because why not? So yeah, my like little boo thing is, is pretty much like what's getting me through the capitalism. So yeah, being an adult sucks. Like I was never one of them kids who wanted to be grown. Like I'm pissed I'm out here living this grown ass life. I've been living alone um, out, in, out in the world by myself for six, seven months now. Now it'll be about seven. And I'm here to tell y'all firsthand, it's pretty fucking ghetto. You know, it's really cool walking around naked until the first of the month hit and you gotta pay 1165 for rent. It's just, it just hurts my feelings a lot. I got me a little wet paper towel to wipe off the access on my thing, but um, yeah, pretty much I'm just over everything. I, I just wanna like, <laughs> I wanna disappear. But I was like, who told me to be a personality? You told me to make this my job. Like, cause now I gotta keep up with it. And then niggas be like, where's the video? Where's the, where, where, where is the videos, man? I don't know. All I got the capacity for is being in love. But all in all, like, I'm not like sad. Like, that's the thing. Like, I think <laughs> I'm not sad. I can tell that like things are kind of, they're on the up in a weird way. It's really weird. It's like, I, if I didn't have the feeling that I was on the up, I would have no other like way to have to tell, you know? <laughs> like every, all odds is pointing to, to down, right? But I just feel in my heart that like shit finna go up. And that's all I got to rely on. So ever since I've been vaccinated, I've just been out living life. And at first I was, I was telling myself like when, um, Outside was closed and niggas was going outside anyway. I was like, I don't want to do that. Like, I don't even know why people are going out anymore. I'm not going out. And here I am. I've been out like three weekends in a row. They got me, y'all. They got me. I'm outside. I'm out fucking side. But it's been a it's been a fun time. I do I did miss finessing these niggas. Ain't nothing like that, you know? I did I did miss that kind of thing. <laughs> Content wise, I just have all these ideas and it's like I'll actually have to 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 do it. Like all this shit I wanna do like requires editing skills and outlines and scripts. Who's doing that? And then like, I don't know, that part of me is like worried that I don't have the qualifications to make the type of videos that I wanna make. So it like holds me back. But like I know that like my videos would be pretty cool. If I ever did them. Um, I don't know, here's your son do the thing you wanna do. I'm not doing it, so you might as well do it for me. Here's your sign. If you was looking for a sign to get your shit together, here it is. And I know your makeup brushes is dirty. Go wash them. Hey, I want to make a whole video discussing the male gaze going back to the finessing these niggas topic from going out and stuff. Like, you know, it is something about men who don't touch you, but like give you things and like admire you for being pretty and then leave you alone. I don't know, still, it, it is kind of fulfilling. I, I, as head of the I Hate These Niggas committee, it, it is kind of fulfilling when, you know, you feel good, you looking good, and, and men give you things for looking good. But like, all the other stuff, like, don't talk to me, I don't wanna give you my number, I don't wanna talk to you, I don't wanna give you my name, I don't know if you know who I am, I don't wanna know who you are, like, just give me the drink. Give me the drink, sir. That's crazy, your weak man ever be thinking about you when you think about him? Cause he was thinking about me, and I was thinking about him. He said I'm about to be out that way if you were around. I was around and I was finna text you. How do you know? Okay, so I guess we can talk about my dependency on weed. I'm really working it out. I'm trying to become less dependent, but it's like, I have ADHD, right? So my emotions is very like, like this is how I feel right now. And that's it. So it takes like a lot for me to change emotions when they're so strong and like so intense. Also a Scorpio moon. So it's just like so intense and so strong. And sometimes I just need a blunt to like calm the fuck down and like re re like reevaluate and realize I don't have to kill myself. <laughs> like the solution be kill myself when shit is going astray. And all it takes is a little blunt to be like, hey Julia, actually you don't gotta kill yourself. Things are looking pretty good. I, sh I need to plug this middle section a little bit more, but other than that, this is looking pretty sexy. I got a hat, y'all wanna see my hat? <laughs> my baby be calling me Big Sexy now. Big Sexy, this hat was $5. I seen it at the beauty store, it was, it was a $5 hat. 
sexy. Why wouldn't I post about it? So now that's my sexy hat, that's I wear that whenever I'm not feeling too sexy and then I feel sexy immediately after I put it on. Trigger warning for, um, you know, sexual assault, Bill Cosby. So that, I'm gonna talk about that in a sec after I get my lace off. So here's your trigger warning right now. If you don't like that, just skip forward a little bit when I'm done talking about him. It probably will be quick. Very much HD, very much my hair, very much my hair. This is exciting. <laughs> this is very exciting. Also, I got this um, this new flat iron. Y'all know I was using my mom's. Y'all, you, know, you can have your shit back now. Yeah. Mom, you can have your stuff back now. That was for you. The other one was for the video. You can have your stuff back. She got her shit back now because I got my own. It's a it's the bedhead pixie cut um flat iron. So so great. It closes real tight. And I don't have to use my hands and like, if I had my nails back, I'd be able to use this. My other one, it was just real, real small. So this is really great. Um, I'm just gonna get, pull up my baby here. And we can keep talking about, unfortunately, Bill Cosby. Um, I don't have much to say about Bill Cosby other than the fact that like, he deserves to go back to jail. Like, I hate the fact that like, he got this loophole. That wasn't really a loophole. Um, basically, if you don't know why he got out of the prison, out of the prison, he got out of the prison because, because what had happened was, in his original like, indictment, is that what it's called? When he, when he got in trouble the first time, like with the first girl, he, they basically said like, hey dude, you tell us the tea, we won't put you in jail. And he took up the offer and then told them all the tea. He told them all the shit. Told, he, he definitely said himself he drugged and, and had sex with the women without their knowledge. And he said this and he told on himself, but it don't matter because because of the agreement they had. So he can't go to jail. He got out of it because they weren't supposed to use that information and they used that information. So real unfortunate, hate that for us, hate that for the women, hate that for all sexual assault survivors. I have to sit there and watch more people get out scot-free on being terrible people. So he's going to the hottest place in hell, the hottest spot. And it's all the people that are defending him and like, you know, I don't know, was he really that great of a TV dad? Like, I don't know. <laughs> Is it really worth, like, the Felicia Rashad and her, like, saying that it was a, a gross, um, a gross something or, I don't, she said something, it was, it was, it was, uh, it was, um, a miscarriage of justice. That's what she said. She said it was a miscarriage of justice. It was when he got the fuck out of prison. I don't know how anyone could hear, like, this man raped over 50 women and think, Get him out of here. Why is he? Get him up out of the jail. He needs to be up under the jail. You already know what I'm finna do. Can you tell? Can you tell what I'm finna do? If you feel it in the energy and the vibe, I'm finna do this half up, half down. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know all the shit I talk, but this one gonna be different. <laughs> you know that's how to get that on my face. <laughs> all right, glad I got this hair on my face now. Um, I'm finna put on my elastic band. And actually, I'm gonna actually, actually, I'm gonna put a, a fuck no, this is in my face like shit. <laughs> I can't even play around like that. Um, I'm just gonna put a little gel on like the uh, the parts that are gonna be underneath the elastic band because I just want them to, I don't know if I'm not gonna put no gel on it, I'm gonna put some gel on it now, okay? I don't got no method to my madness so fun. And then you gotta grab your trusty old dirty ass brush. Y'all like this scrunchie? Y'all can't even see it, yeah, hold on. Y'all like this scrunchie right here with all this hair in it? That's unfortunate. This scrunchie right here. You got a set collection. Um, new collection dropping soon. I y'all ain't hear that from me though. So, you know, subscribe to set collections email list. I'll leave um the website down below where you can get the scrunchie from. And I'm I don't know if her site is still open. I think it is. But she'll have a new color dropping soon, so you should subscribe to that mailing list or you're gonna miss out. And then I would hate to be you when you miss out. Being on social media sucks now. <laughs> Like, it's like, it's harder and harder for me to want to tell y'all what I think every day. Or like, even see what y'all have to say about what y'all think. Like, not y'all, not y'all. No, I'm not talking to y'all. I know y'all cool as fuck. But the people with bad opinions and who support Bill Cosby and shit. Like, I didn't need to know that, you know? Don't you miss life when you didn't know people were terrible? And now I just gotta know that everybody fucking sucks. So it's just getting, it's getting real draining to find out every week that somebody else sucks. A little wet line. Bam, I think. I hope that wasn't terrible. 
They don't seem like it was terrible. Okay, so sometimes like I just like to like, you know. And then when I'm done, I'll go ahead and put a scarf on so that it'll flatten this area out. But this is pretty good. I don't know when's the last time I just did this shit on this shit on one try. I feel like this deserves a round of applause. So I'm gonna applause for the applause. Thank you. Thank you so much. Okay, now I'm gonna stop playing. I'm gonna uh, just wrap this around real quick because it don't matter for now. And I'm about to, ooh. My lace is kind of lifting right there, but I'm gonna just plug this a little bit because it's just a little too thick for my liking. And this is what they look like. I always feel like I got on a wig when I put on a wig, but then I remember like I went through the process of putting on this wig, so like, duh, I have on a wig, you know? Makeup time. After I put on this scarf, because I just wanna flatten this, uh, my half of half downs always look real wiggy to me when they first get on here, so I just like to just, you know, put her down a little bit. Makeup time. We can uh, take my hair out in the back and in the front. I gotta do my brows off camera though. I lied, I thought we was gonna get into some things. We not, give me two seconds. <laughs> so I know you like, girl, why couldn't you do this on camera? I didn't want to. So I have my brows on, all I did was just underline them with some concealer, bam, bam. And then I'm about to do my little, my little five, 10 minute makeup routine. Um, this is the makeup routine I do when I got somewhere to go. And it looks like I got somewhere to go. Um, I was on pretty decent on time, but you know me. I don't know if you if you guys used to come to my lives. I haven't been on Instagram live in a long time. I should probably get back on Instagram live. Y'all know me. I'm always running late, but I pulls it together. This is just my LA Girl Pro Concealer. All uh, all my products will be down in the description box. Hello. Are you getting ready? No. Oh, okay. When were you gonna do that? No, uh, I wasn't. I was just gonna go like this. So when were you gonna do that? <laughs> Are you sure you're ready? Yeah, I think when you do this to me, it was like the other day, you, I, I, I heard you do it again. You was like, so you gonna do your hair? Was I supposed to sit there and let you not do your hair? Like what? <laughs> no, it was just how you did it. You was like- How, how am I supposed to say things? So you wasn't fucking with it? No, I'm not fucking with it. And that's your problem. <laughs> and that's my problem. <laughs> I mean, breath stinking, hair frizzy, pits musty. I'm so glad that bitch finally left. Yeah, I know. I don't know what he's doing. He said, he was at Vegas, he spent $16 on a pack of that. Yeah, he said, he was at Vegas, he spent $16 on a pack of that. I would've rolled up in a, in a leaf from outside. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, McDonald's got too many chickens and a fry and pay $8. What size fry? Two chickens is $2. <laughs> what if you got a, the biggest fry there was? You said only like he got an extra one. <laughs> he could have. I don't know what they got out there. He said that all the clubs, like all the clubs down there is expensive, which makes sense. But you know how clubs in Atlanta be like $100. He said to get a $12,000. Who has $12,000 for one night? It's giving wedding. You can get married for that. Yeah, you can get married for that. $12,000 for one night. You don't, it don't even come with the bitches. <laughs> it's zero bitches, all niggas, 12 bands. It was a table. It's not even a table. 12 bands to be at a table, my niggas. For them, that could have been two hundred dollars for everybody. <laughs> that don't make sense. I'm bad. <laughs> There's no way somebody's gonna touch me to my face two hundred dollars. I need to pay two hundred dollars to get in this club. You need to give me two hundred dollars to get in this club. You You're playing. Do you see this scalp? This is gonna make me pay two hundred dollars. Weird. I can't get no Woods. I can't get no McDonald's. It's giving stay in Ohio. No bitches. No bitches. <laughs> Like, I don't know, like, what am I, what are you getting out of this? I want five bottles. I want all the bottles. Doing all that, and I was over here like, yeah, I want to make it. He said it's expensive, but he said he lost five pounds. I don't know how many pounds he lost. Like, he said he was going to win, and then he just did. 
He wasn't gonna win. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was crazy. We come on our own back when we go to Vegas. Four McChickens on deck. You know them two. With us. That's, that's how the only thing I'm spending exu it, wait, an, exu an exuberant amount of money on is the weed. That's it. Well, I was asking about the dispensaries, and it sounded pretty normal, like some of the outfit page, so I wasn't even mad at it. Oh, okay. I got this little hair cuff I'm gonna put in my hair from Shein. You probably get this from the, the hair store, like the beauty supply, but I got it from Shein, and I never used it before, and I thought I should do it now. So, I am. I wonder why you want somebody to sing. Come on, it's saying. What do you mean? Coming in America. Bark like a dog. What if I came back tomorrow and killed it for y'all? Cause I think I will take pictures, right, and show y'all the outfit. But I, I'm, it's, it's the time is this is ticking, right? And I gotta go with my friends. So what if I just came back tomorrow with the same exact look and just show y'all what I what I would wear, what I wore last weekend? Is that okay? Cause that's what's gonna happen. And if I didn't edit this, like if I didn't tell y'all this and I just did it. Like, I don't think y'all would notice. So, I'm gonna do it. So, I will see y'all tomorrow. Here I am being truthful about it, though. See y'all tomorrow. I'm gonna show you the fit that I wore that one day. Um, this is my makeup. I was just on some lashes. Um, I'm not gonna wear lashes because I'm going to the movies. This is the hair. I'm gonna see y'all tomorrow for the fit. <laughs> it's the next day. But if I didn't tell you that, I bet y'all wouldn't have known. I bet, like, maybe the shimmer on my lashes and my wig sliding, you know, two inches back would have gave it away. But if you want to keep on watching to see the details on this outfit, you can. But if you're done, you tapped out, that's fine. Thanks for watching. Um, we can get into the outfit details. I did, um, but, oh, before I, uh, like, kick y'all the fuck out, um, I ended up adding some shimmer to my eye in the center on the slit. I like it. I don't know, it was easy. I'm gonna do a little uh, mock for you. I said, I said, right like right here? Yeah, I like it on my eyes. And then my lips are just a brown lip pencil and then I have this Morphe gloss. I don't know why I'm telling y'all like this ain't gonna be in the description box, but I'm gonna let you know. It's gonna be also in the description box. I will let you know as soon as I find that Morphe gloss I'm talking about. Well, I don't know what I said, so I'm gonna just put it in the description box. I tried. Um, and then I just put a little concealer on top of my lips to get them real pink. I thought the pink was, was real cute. Before we finish up though, for real, for real, one more thing, let's hope I can find that. I'm running out. Um, shout out to Brina Cole for sending me her whole collection. I didn't use the whole thing of mousse. I like the conditioner, I like the shampoo. The whole keratin line is really nice. So you should definitely check out the Brina Cole collection. Um, I'll leave a link down below to send me her whole entire line. I've used your whole mousse, girl. I really like it. I like it on my real hair, I like it on my wigs. I like I like both the all the products on my real hair and my wigs. So Brie Nicole collection, check her out. I'm gonna just put a little bit of this mousse on the uh, front parts of this because I feel like it kind of got you know like really big. And I wanted this to be big, but like I wanted to also look defined a little bit. So just a little mousse right here. And yeah, this is the look. So stay tuned to keep watching if you want to see the outfit details. Okay, it's you. It's me in a different place. Who would have thought? All right, so I got this shirt from Boohoo, and it's a plus size shirt, I think it's a 12. I didn't have another silk shirt like this, and I, I like the color a lot. So I got it, but I said that in the Boohoo travel hall, so if you're looking for other Boohoo stuff, look at that, and then these shorts. It's from Baby Fat. Yeah, and then I got this belt from Shein, and I got these heels from Boohoo as well, but they hurt. So bad. So here's the picture I took. Right here. Here's what the shoes look like on. I'm not putting them on right now. Yeah. And they're gold. And then I also got this bag from Shein. And I'll put my hair back. Here's a look. That's it. These shoes hurt like shit. I'm not playing. I don't recommend them anymore. They were real cute at first. And they're not cute no more. So yeah, here's a look. Hope, hope everybody enjoyed. I'm gonna fuck with y'all. It's been real. I'll see my next video. Bye, beautiful. You know I got some flaps over there. Yeah. <laughs>